Be curious. Anytime I don't know something, the first thing I do is say, I don't know that. It's what makes some of my best relationships so beautiful is because back and forth, we talk. We talk about what we think. We talk about what we think we know. And we investigate because we're curious. So I say, I don't know that. And then the person that I'm talking with says, oh yeah, that's this, this, and that. I look it up. I didn't know it. That person was slightly wrong. Now we both know what it is. We both found the truth. And the person that I'm with doesn't resent that I looked it up because they weren't sure. They had an idea, but they weren't sure. And when we can all function from this place of, I have an idea, but I'm not sure because most of us are genuinely functioning from this place, whether we think we know or not, but we don't know what we don't know. And we have to remember this. We have to hold on to that. We don't know what we don't know. And we are human with memories that are fallible. Think about how many people think there was a movie called Shazam with Shaq in it or thought it was pronounced the Berenstein Bears rather than the Berenstain Bears as it is spelled. We as a humans assume things, but when we can stop assuming things by recognizing when we're making assumptions and instead, and there's no excuse for this because we have knowledge at our fingertips at all times in our phones, instead look them up and then contemplate and chew on that and maybe not even take your first place you find it from, but multiple sources into consideration. Then we are just starting the journey of freedom.